I'm always working on finding filaments that are new to me that I can try for things. And I've been on the hunt for a good gold filament for a while. Also, I've tried these marble filaments a couple of times. I tried some random brand, and then I went ahead and tried this G Tech. I've looked at their filaments before on the channel, and I was pretty impressed, so I decided to get some others and check them out. So I would like to first thank the sponsor of this video, PCBWay, and tell you a little bit about what they do. Here we are in PCBWay's site. You've got you know, your instant quote, CNC 3D printing, PCB assembly. They have product capabilities here listed that show you all the different kinds of PCBs and things they can do. They've got projects here that are shared, so you can go in and find things that you might want to do. But the thing that really is cool to me is they do 3D printing. When I need something printed in metal, I come here. I upload my STL or similar file. I put up what the quantity I want, design units, material, all this stuff. And you just send off the quote when it's done, someone checks it, and once they've decided that it's gonna be viable, they send you the price. Thanks PCBWay for sponsoring this video. I really, really do appreciate it. You guys rock. Okay, thanks PCBWay. Um, yeah, like, let's start with the gold. So I'm always looking for a good gold, and this one actually looks kind of satisfying. I've done other golds on the channel. I did that um, Indiana Jones fertility idol. I was looking around for it. I don't see it. My wife must have put it somewhere. And it, I just wasn't quite happy with it. And I did some other golds. and But yeah, this one someone recommended. And I decided to check it out. I printed a few things here. I used this aztec mayan forgive me i don't know pyramid in another video just to check out uh i think it was actually the other g tech video i did it here in their gray and i was very satisfied with it so i went ahead and decided to try the gold and get this text out of the way like pretty happy with how that came out like especially the where it was touching the pei plate uh, it's got a nice little texture to it but yeah, like that came out really nice. Um, the first thing I did though <laughs> was a golden calf just because I had to, because right, it's a funny joke. Um, these things are really pointy. But yeah, he came out pretty good. The, this would have been an issue with anything on the model. You know, you got a little rounding and stuff right there. But I was, I was pretty happy with how that looked. And I'm like, yeah, let's play with this some more. And then, you know, the pyramid was the last thing I did. I did this key. Uh, came out really nice. Took forever because it printed what well, like that, <laughs> so it had a lot of supports. But like, isn't that great? Let me show you the other side here. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. I was very satisfied with how that came out. And then I was like, well, let's try doing a chain or something. And yeah, like. Let me show you the both sides at once here. And you know, where it comes in contact with the plate, obviously I was using a PEI plate. You could get a smooth plate or something and it'd probably look a little better. Even using like my cool plate, the texturing is much more subdued and it would have been good. But on the part that wasn't textured, I think that came out really nice. Um, yeah, like just very, very happy with that. That G Tech, it's just their PLA, their standard PLA in gold. So let's slide all this out of the way here. And I did some stuff with their marble one, but not as much. So let's take a look at that. First, I did this little uh, ruins here. Came out pretty decent. Um, with the marble, I just wasn't sure what to do. I originally did a bust, and my wife was uh, a bit scandalized because of the female curviness of it so she asked me <laughs> to not do a video with that so i went ahead and threw it away but uh, <laughs> you know happy wife happy life but yeah so the ruins came out all right so then i was thinking oh how about we do some roman columns lay these down so they actually fit in the frame focus thank you and yeah so i was pretty happy with these let me get you a close up here, focus. Came out really nice. Um, if you actually had something to use this marble for, uh, I think you would be very happy. Like, just very satisfying. 
there you can see like the marble texture a little pretty cool and then you know this one's smoother kind of appreciate it a little bit more and then lastly when I see these I want to go into the uh, lecture the Freemasonry lecture about the columns <laughs> they've been sitting here for a few days and it just keeps running through my head but yeah pretty cool and again that was just the GTEC um, marble filament really really excited you know I kind of want to have PCB way make um, I don't know should I get them to make one of these in metal for me how cool would this be printed in tool steel <laughs> but yeah so Thanks, PCBVA, for sponsoring this video. I love you guys. I, I really love what you do, too. You make such cool stuff. Um, I love that aluminum benchy I have. Like, it's the greatest thing. I really need to use their printing service more for some more exotic and fun and, and wacky stuff. And, yeah. Uh, thanks for stopping by, guys, and I'll see you in the next video.